I remember when I first saw The Matrix, I didn't go to the cinema because I wasn't really interested. I remember when I first saw The Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring, I didn't go to the cinema because I wasn't really interested. I remember when I first saw Harry Potter, uh, you get the idea. It's like that. It's, um, yeah, so we didn't have a lot of internet back then in Hungary, and the culture did not develop yet. YouTube wasn't a thing. The only way to see trailers was to catch one or two on TV, maybe. The TV stations preferred to show trailers of their own upcoming showtimes. So, I don't even remember whether there was any, any on TV. Well, anyways, fun times. Nowadays, I can watch all the trailers I want on YouTube, read the reviews, and be informed as much as I want to. Though, in all honesty, the most enjoyment I get out of films is when I just go to the cinema because of the title and the short description and maybe the poster. It also helps that I have this unlimited cinema card at Cineworld for £17. Pounds, 15 seven, whatever. A month. I can watch all the movies I want to. Yay! Now, when I first saw the Star Wars prequel came coming out, everybody seemed to like it. Well, probably. Who knows? I don't think I had any internet back then. I know, right? I had no information. And nobody was there to criticize it. In 2017, though, when The Last Jedi came out, oh boy, people, people created theories about it and then got upset when the film showed something else. I don't like The Last Jedi much, but I do appreciate the middle finger it gave to all the theorists. Spoilers ahead. Just, you've been warned. The main protagonist, Ray's mysterious parents are nobodies. The main villain, Snoke, dies. The finally found Luke Skywalker doesn't care about things anymore. Film, at least blockbuster films, have become the target of people wanting to munch on them. Are they doing it for the views on YouTube or page download counts for their blog posts? Uh, is, is the page download count still a thing today, though? Or is it Facebook likes? No, never mind. I'll never know. I see these clickbait titles such as Snoke's identity finally revealed. We found out whose Ray's parents are. The truth behind Molly's game. Oh, wait. That last one is probably not a thing, is it? No. Molly's game is quite a good film, but not mainstream enough to attract views. So nobody really cares about it. I I'm not, I'm not criticising this, this criticising culture we have now. It it's fairly Hungarian, actually. I feel like at home. A new film comes out. And everyone's first reaction is, it's probably shit. Woo! Hungarian culture is going mainstream now. Though I'm sure lots of culture has their own negative views on life. It's not healthy. It's, it's something I don't miss from Hungary. I can certainly live without it. But hey, it's the times we live in right now. Lately, I just ignore all the clickbait stuff. I just check what's on in the movie theatre, read the title, read the description, look at the poster. Yay for old school marketing! Go watch Molly's Game though. It's quite good. It must be out on DVD now or something. And have a great day. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.